Hi there, and welcome to the ProxySale channel. My name is Andrew. In today's tutorial, I'll show you how to configure a proxy in Adobe Creative Cloud. This setup is especially useful for accessing features that might be restricted in your region due to geolocation. Let's get started. Indeed, Adobe Creative Cloud does not provide a direct method for setting a proxy within the application. However, you can still use a proxy either by configuring your entire operating system or by using a program like Proxifier to apply a proxy specifically for Adobe Creative Cloud. I'll walk you through both methods. Let's start by learning how to configure a proxy for the entire operating system using Windows 10 as our example. Click on Start, then navigate to Settings and choose Network and Internet. In the window that appears, click on Proxy. Activate User Proxy Server. This makes the fields for entering the proxy details active. Enter the IP and port of your proxy. Once everything is set, click on Save. When working in Adobe Creative Cloud and performing any action, if you are using a private proxy, a window will appear requesting the username and password for your proxy. Enter this information and you are ready to proceed with your work. Here's how to set up a proxy for Adobe Creative Cloud using the Proxifier. Launch Proxifier. Click on the Profiles tab at the top, then select Proxy Servers. In the window that appears, click on Add to enter your proxy details. Fill in the address and port fields with the IP and port of your proxy. In the Protocol section, select the appropriate protocol type. If your proxy is public, you don't need any further authorization. If it's a private proxy, activate authentication and enter the username and password below. After entering the details, test the proxy by clicking Check. If a green message appears, the proxy is functioning and ready to use. A red message indicates that the proxy is not working and you'll need to find a functional one. Once everything is verified, click OK, then Yes. To link the proxy specifically to Adobe Creative Cloud, return to the Profiles tab and select Proxification Rules. Click Add to create a new rule. In the window that appears, set a name for the rule and in the Applications section choose the Adobe Creative Cloud executable file from your computer. In the Action field, select the proxy you just set up to be used with the Adobe Creative Cloud. Click OK. With these settings, Adobe Creative Cloud will use the proxy whenever it's running, ensuring it only applies to this application. Let me remind you that your work as well as your accounts may be at risk if you operate with free proxies that can be found on a network. Such proxies do not have guarantees of anonymity and security. We recommend a reliable and trusted provider ProxySale.com which will allow you to get proxies of any location with guaranteed anonymity and security for working on a network. The link will be in the description. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons. See you in the next video.